What would you do if you happily let someone cut you in line and then they won $10,000 for being the one millionth customer? Would you still be friendly or would you try to take the money for yourself? Today we're going to be doing a ton of different tests to answer the question, will people do anything for money? Because I think everyone has a price. To start this video, I'm going to take this $100 bill and ask people if they dropped it even though no one did. Excuse me, you didn't drop this, did you? Did you drop this? Did you drop this? So serious? Are you the one that dropped this right here? No. No, I did not. Did Dude, I feel like this mall is just too fancy. Like the people don't even want to take it. Like if you can hear it, they're literally playing violin music in here. And after filming for hours with no luck, we decided to try somewhere not quite as nice. This was an understatement because according to Google, this city has one of the highest crime rates in all of America. Now let's see if that includes that. How much you want to bet within the first three people we ask, someone tries to take the money. Keep the camera roll. We'll just get this first guy. Did you drop this? It's not yours? You have a good day, man. You know, maybe I shouldn't judge this mall before we walk around over there. Oh, man. Did you drop us? Yeah. You had 100 on you? Bring out the camera. Bring it out. Man, you failed the test, man. Come on. No shame. We finally got someone after filming for three hours, but we've been filming at this mall for 10 minutes. <laughs> oh, jeez. Is this yours? Yeah. Oh, I just dropped it. Oh my gosh, man, you gotta be careful. <laughs> Pause. I just come from the other side. It was a setup and you failed. Uh, come on, man, come on. Hey, you tell the truth next time, okay? You dropped it out of your pocket? Oh, it actually is yours? Yeah, it came out of my pocket right here. We set it up. Oh. Yeah. You set it up. You failed the test, man. Hey, you have a good day, though. <laughs> of course, people are willing to lie for a quick buck, but what about something a little more permanent? So I found a tattoo artist and the boys and I made our way to Florida. Oh my gosh, it is pouring, bro. It's been raining all day. Come no on, way, boys. bro. <laughs> Come on. We made it. Uh, yeah. Carson? This is my friend Carson. And he doesn't know it yet, but for the next part of this video, I'm gonna pay a stranger to get a tattoo of his face. This has gotta be one of the best ideas I've ever come up with. Usually people wouldn't be going around getting random tattoos, but would they if we offer them a little bit of money? We got this $500 cash right here. Let's see who we can get. Do you guys have any guys working here that would be down to get a tattoo for $500? I only have two guys here and one's a minor. Okay, definitely not. <laughs> you guys have a great day. You gotta finesse them a little bit. You gotta like pull out the cash and like, like thumbing through it in front of their face. You know, get that emotional attachment so they want to do it. Would you be down to get a random tattoo for five hundred dollars? Random tattoo for five hundred dollars? Yeah, just right across the street. Are you kidding me? No, I'm being dead serious. Really? So five hundred cash. And all you gotta do is get a little tattoo. I get to choose it or you choose it. I, I choose it. I can show you what it is. This is the artwork. Interesting. Where you? Huh? Somewhere. Wherever somewhere. you want, man. Wherever you want. Yeah, all right. I'll do it. <laughs> You'll do it? I'll do it. That was way easier than I thought it would be. All right, you want to follow us over yeah, there? Sure. Let's go, man. This is Alan, a retired police officer from Baltimore. And he told us after having a brush with death due to a brain tumor a few years back, he's learned to live a little bit more spontaneous. You know, you never know how long you got to live and what's the matter. I love it. I love you know, it, man. What's the matter? How long is this clip from when we introed it to when we found him? Yeah, it literally took us two minutes and 41 seconds to find someone. I guess money talks. Also, huge shout out to Evan at Point of Entry Tattoo in Englewood, Florida, because we would not have been able to pull this off without him. So if you guys need a tattoo, this is the man you need to come to. He's hooking us up today, helping us out with this video. So just for that, come give him some business. Are you ready? Let's go. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Oh, oh nice. yeah. Oh, it's so good. Deal is a deal. As you can see right here, he got it done. So there's the rest of the money, man. Now. We got to get Carson's reaction. If you had to guess anything right now of what our surprise is for you, what would you think it is? The tip piercing or something? We're not getting the tip of your pierced, bro. Wait, 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 would you do it? Like, I'll pay for it right now. No. <laughs> I want you to meet somebody. This is my friend, Alan. Bro. What's up? What's up? We wanted to show you something. Awesome. <laughs> we paid him $500 to get a tattoo of your face. <laughs> <laughs> this random guy you just met is going to have your face on his body for the rest of his life. When did you meet him? Dude, this is, we found him in Goodwill 10 minutes ago. This is a random guy. <laughs> you didn't know that? I thought you like We do not know this guy, Carson. <laughs> so people will lie and permanently mark their bodies for money, but this next test is by far my favorite. We got permission to film a video at this gas station where I'll be cutting people in line and then winning this giant check for being the one millionth customer. 
First, we have my friend Brady stall at the register until a line forms behind him. How's it going, boss? Hey, I'm good. Do you guys have Apple Pay? Then I move in and cut in front of the unsuspecting customers. Excuse me. Sorry. Sorry. As soon as I check out, the other boys come from the back of the store to give me my prize. This giant $10,000 check. This could get a little ugly. Congratulations! You are the millionth customer. No way. Of this establishment, yes. And you we would like to right in front of me. No way. Well, we would like to hit you with a $10,000 check. <laughs> this might be the luckiest day of your life. <laughs> well, he cut. No, I, I, was, I was in here first. No, you said no, excuse you me while I was standing here, and then you went right in front of me. You guys were one away from winning 10. No, I was standing here. Just be a little quicker next time, right I guess. Cheaters always win, you know? Excuse me? I'm sorry. I'm just in like a huge rush. Do you mind if I just hop in front of you? Family situations, hospital stuff, you know? Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry, sorry. No, don't worry. Sorry. Watch out real quick. Let me get back. Excuse me, can I hop in front of you real quick? My mom just went into labor. Do you mind if I just hop in front of you real quick? I'm kind of in a rush. I'm sorry. Excuse me, sorry. I'm kind of in a rush. Can I pop ahead of you? I just have this. Thank you. Hi. I just need that water, that's all. Congratulations! Come on down! Winner, winner, chicken dinner! I hope you've got an umbrella because it's raining money. On behalf of Gas and Express Mart. On behalf of Gas and Express Mart. On behalf of Gas and Express Mart. You, sir, are our one million. One million. One million. One million customer. Today, sir, you are going home with a $10,000 check. No, uh, no way. I'm the million? Yeah. You're lying. No, I, I, this is not. No way. Uh, he wants to get a photograph oh, of it? You're darn skippy, I do, boys. <laughs> this happened to me in line today. Thank you. Guys, you. you guys were that close. <laughs> Are you serious? Nationwide, millionth customer. What were you buying here today? A bottle of water. And that might have been the best return on investment wow. ever made in the history. You guys know what I'm saying. This is for me. Yeah. I should have been first, but I let him go. Even though I didn't tell him he can't go. You just have to be a little quicker next time, man. Second place, I, I mean, I'm sorry. First reactions, and he... Well, I was, I was behind him. He... It's okay. Yeah, you were second place. It's okay though, because this is actually brought to you by Prime Hydration, and we'd like to give you a Prime. We are rewarding no you way. with a ten thousand dollar check. One millionth customer. No way. Thank you, Gas and Express Mart. I couldn't have got here without my mom, my grandma. I left my ID in my car, and that's why I missed it. Brother, welcome to my world. <laughs> this is Gas and Express Mart's nationwide uh, millionth customer. Everything's on me. I got all you guys. Go ahead, yeah. Go ahead. No way. Yes, this is, this is serious. No way. <laughs> Any words from back in line? I just want my stuff. No way. Yeah, no, no way. You are exactly our one millionth customer. <laughs> one millionth and one customer. Any? I wish I were a little bit. Oh, he, I, you got him? No, no, I'm just joking. Did he actually cut you? No. You guys were 20 seconds away from winning $10,000. <laughs> You're taking this home today. This is yours. Man, you were next in line. How, first thoughts, impressions? No, thanks. Today you are going home with a $10,000 check. No. Yeah. No way. Oh, are you guys together? I let him go before me, so oh. that's cool. Well, no just give it, give way. Give me one second. There's your check. There is a little twist to this, so you are going to have a chance to win some money as well. Okay. You're going home today with $10,000 no matter what. We want to give you the opportunity to give away some money. Would you rather give him $10,000 as well? Or we double your total and you go home with $20,000. Double, 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 double. You want to double yourself? <laughs> okay. There's another There's another $10,000. <laughs> and then also that prime hydration, that only has 20 calories. So. All right, thank you. Yeah, no problem. And if I give him the $10,000, I get to keep mine? Yeah. Double it, double it. You want to double yours? Y yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have the opportunity to give her ten thousand dollars, or you can double it and you du take double home, it. Double it. You double take it. home yeah, twenty. Yes, please. That's crazy. <laughs> double mine. Double mine. Double mine. Okay. okay. There's another ten thousand. Are you serious? Yeah. You're, You're going home today with a ten thousand dollar <gasps> check, sir. You're right behind him in line. No. You're not behind him. No. I don't speak English actually. Thank you. I have to let this off my, my conscience. I cut him in line. I don't want to leave him empty handed. Sir, I, I can't let you go out of here empty handed. I have a fuel savings card for Marathon and th that. I do feel kind of bad since you let me go since you let me go in front. Here, this is Chipotle gift card, yeah. I wish I would have let him cut me, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, what? Well, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You guys go ahead, I'll ring up. I got Good it. List, it's my man. Yeah. Good list. Dang, you only ran up 24 Wait, there's only $24 for all of yeah. it? You need to go do about four to five hours of paperwork. Do you have anything planned today? No, my schedule's cleared. Yeah, but I thought you were in a hurry a few minutes ago. Yeah, we're just, just messing with you. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I thought we're totally just messing with you. Oh, it's not real. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're totally messing with you, man. It's not real. Oh. <laughs> you can keep the prime, though. That part's real. <laughs> Speaking of giveaways, I'm going to be giving away $500 to one of you guys on my new Discord server. 